Hello friends, my name is Narendra and in this video I will tell you how can you enter integer type value in your ODK form. Okay, so here I am using Google spreadsheet. Why I am using Google spreadsheet? I am using Google spreadsheet because this has a feature of automatic scheduling, which is one of the best. Many times when we are working on our desktop in Excel, then that might be crashed because of shutdown down or anything happens but in this case when you are using google spreadsheet nothing will gonna it will be automatically save on your computer even your computer will shut down okay so here we already know that for making any form in open data kit in excel we need to make a spreadsheet with three tabs those are survey choices and settings okay in survey we need to enter each and everything which should be reflect on odk screen variables and data type okay so this is a type here we need to enter data type in this video i am explaining about basic of integer so data type is integer and here we need to enter variable name. So suppose i am entering age variable name which will getting value of age what is your okay. so my question is what is your age variable name is age and data type is integer so when you will export this data from your server if a variable is getting value of age, it means that variable have value age. ODK is one of the best software for auto labeling. That's why we used ODK. Okay. Now one more question, which is asking about the integer value, which is phone underscore number. Okay, I'm asking about phone number. What is your phone number? Okay. In label, we need to enter the thing which we want to show on the phone screen okay. in choices as we are using simple thing in form select one select one which we are not using so we need we can simply make it blank in setting we need to enter form title form identifier language form title is one of the most important thing like right now i am making a video series that's why i am making this note with because it's my third video on how you can learn odk form id same thing so you can put the form id relevant to your form and survey default language in advanced course i will tell you how can you add a default language of your otk form okay so this is our form which is ready if we are getting we, if we are taking only the things of age and phone number now uh, we need to convert this form into xml so we can upload that form on the server here is a tool which is, which is XLS form, open slash XLS form. You can get this link from comment from my description of this video. Here I'm uploading the form. For uploading the form, I need to download. So I'm downloading this form, this from Microsoft Excel. It's downloaded. Now I need to browse this form. So here is the form. Here is the form. I need to upload it, submit it. It's submitting, it's converting. After converting, either you can download it or you can preview it and can to. I'm clicking on preview and can to. So here, my ODK form will look like this. What is your age? I can enter my age. What is your phone number? I can enter 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. One thing more thing, I am pressing star dot button, but it's not entering. Okay. So let me open on a screen key keyboard so you can see. Right now, so this is my on screen keyboard. Now, here I am entering numbers. Okay, numbers. So, this is three. Now, I am I want to enter point. This is integer. 